Okay. Um, as people are preparing for the qualifiers, obviously mm. they're wondering if they're going to be enough spaces on the PBP with the quota. Um, the arrangements have, have, have changed, um, and the people are wondering at what point the quotas will be applied, and if there are spare places, how will they will be distributed? Yes, uh, we we had we are working right now on a six thousand riders uh, basis. Right, six thousand. Uh, six thousand. Uh, it could be a lot uh, compared with two thousand seven. Mm. But uh, we know we could have more than uh, 6,000 riders. So, in fact, we are able, we know we can open a little bit more, perhaps 6,500. Yeah. 6, we'll see uh, if we can open or not uh, more than 6,000 mm -hmm. uh, places. We try to accept everyone. Right. It's w it's our goal to accept everyone. Everybody who but wants to do it. We are not sure about that, really. Right. And we, we don't want to accept more people than 6,500, let's say, mm -hmm. and to have major problem uh, in the control because yes. of uh, we, if we have don't have enough places in the control, mm -hmm. it will be a big, big, big uh, In accepting issue. that 6,500, are you then expecting some to drop out and so you'll end up yes. with 6,000 yes, at the end? That's yeah, it. Yeah. Exactly. So you'll accept people early and expect them to drop out rather than wait for dropouts and then mm. distri redistributing those numbers? Uh, not redistributing, but no. I think perhaps if we accept 6,500 people, You'll we'll have the at the out. start yeah. uh, only 6,200 or yeah. 300 people yeah. starting. So people will know early on if they're going to be doing it or not, mm. don't they? Yes. It won't yeah. be at the last minute. Yeah, yeah sure. That would be good. Yeah. Um, the um, the internet and technology has made a huge difference to the oh, yes. to the to mm -hmm. and to the PVP. Uh, do you think we're still connected to the spirit of the pioneers who started out PVP? It's a big question. Uh, of course, some people are saying yes. With the GPS, it's not the same. Uh, yes. Yes, of course. But in fact, you are still riding. You are mm. still you are still on your bicycle and you are doing all the same effort, even if. You are uh, looking at your GPS and not at the arrows on the, on the, on the road. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, that's right. It's not exactly the same, but uh, we are always uh, doing uh, uh, amelioration improvements uh, year after year, and uh, GPS are uh, mm. a kind of improvement. I think we have to be connected also with our time and to, uh, to do PVP. Uh, with the uh, tools we have now. Mm -hmm. uh, I remember, it's, it's just as far from Paris to Brest as it ever was, isn't yes, it? Yes, it's the same distance. <laughs> <laughs> it's always the same distance. <coughs> remember, uh, Charles Théron, at the beginning of PBP, used the first tires, uh, removable tires. Uh -huh. It was a big improvement, and he used them. Yes. Right, yes, yes. yes. And so they had paces to begin with as yes, well, didn't yeah, they? For sure. yes, yes, I think what's interesting is that some riders make it hard for themselves by mm. choosing bicycles that are obviously mm. going to be slow and difficult to, yeah. to ride as well. That's right. Um, yeah. It's their pressure, they want to do it like this. Why not? Mm -hmm. But to make okay. it fun. It's, f it's fun for them. Mm -hmm. Okay, and that's, uh, I think that's the most important to do it for himself, herself. Yeah. Yes. Do it just for yourself, just for yourself, mm. and after that, uh, apply the rules. We have some rules, of course. You don't have to take a car between two control, no. just your bicycle. Yes. But uh, as far as you are respecting the rules, uh, you can do it uh, as you want. Yes. Sure. Right. Yes. Mm.